Well, good morning, Lionhearts. First day in the new bed, and it was awesome. I already got up to go to the bathroom, and first thing I noticed, no back pain. Awesome. Second thing I noticed was, after they delivered the bed, after I took off and went and got new bed risers, and had to reset the bed up myself, and knocked over just about everything in my apartment doing it, which somehow I didn't break anything, go figure. I noticed that uh, when I lay down on the bed, this is the first time in probably 15 years that my um, ankles don't hang off the end of the bed. I'm so tall that I finally have a bed that I completely fit on, so awesome. Great times, feeling great, and uh, I don't know, Adam and I were talking about going to see, um, today is Ringo Starr's birthday, and he always does like kind of a peace and love thing over at Capitol Records, and Adam asked me if I wanted to go today, so I think that's probably what we'll do for the vlog, I'm not sure yet. You guys know me. I change my mind a lot. I never know what I want to do, and uh, who knows? Let's see where the day takes us. Days with Jordan the Lion begins now. Well, Lion Hearts, it is a beautiful day to be alive. Hope you're all well today, and uh, it really put a big smile on my face to start seeing yesterday and today that people have been sending me messages telling me that they're getting mail from me and how happy and excited they are that they got it. So. Everybody that I owed mail to, it should be on its way. I've sent everything that I know of, so if you don't get it in a week, send me a message. I want to make sure I uh, make right on everybody. I want to do something nice for you guys, so thank you for everything you've done for me. Well, I was feeling a little nostalgic today, so I'm, I think my wardrobe kind of shows that I've got the David Bowie Aladdin Sane shirt on. I've got the uh, red Air Force One shoes. And I think I might even go put on my uh, Harlem Globetrotters wristband just to round it out. And after I get done with this walk, I'm gonna make a little short video because last night while I was asleep, the viewers of this channel did something extremely nice for me. And I wanna tell you guys and thank you guys for doing it. Told you I wasn't messing around. Well, they obviously have the streets blocked off for Ringo's birthday, and I'm not a huge Beatles fan, but I do love Ringo in all the movies. I loved all the crazy stories that he's involved in, and uh, today, we might see Paul McCartney, we might see Yoko. Wait a second. We might see this guy. You're not a Beatles fan? Eh. All right, man, our friendship just ended. Here he goes. <laughs> well, we're here at Capitol Records, and they are celebrating Ringo. They have a drum set and everything set up, so it looks like we might get a performance of some sort. Well, we've decided to stake our claim over here because it seems to be the least congested spot of everything. And hopefully, we'll get a Ringo sighting. Like I said, I always loved uh, Ringo's movie appearances more. I liked him in as Larry the Dwarf and Frank Zappa's 200 Motels, and then of course all the Beatle movies, and then Caveman, and uh, I know it's not really like a film credit, film credit, but The Last Waltz, I mean, I was a huge fan of that movie, and Ringo's in that, so, so it'd be pretty exciting. I switched camera lenses so I could kind of experiment, and they're actually gonna, um, put flags going across this uh, this back barrier right here for every country of the world. Getting ready to set that up now. Thank you all for coming out. Yay. A lot of Ringo's heavy friends are here. It's got Edgar Winter, Yay. Billy Walsh, Van Dyke Park, Louis Lofton, and his theme, kids. In this love of mine, keep Mr. Don Was.
about me. Uh, we got three minutes. Here's what this is. This is a peace and love moment. Ringo's had these all around the world. Now look, the way things are going to get better is if we have each other's backs. Okay? And that is done by peace and love. So we're going to go peace and love. Now, everybody's here and we're standing in the street, but the whole world is going to see this. Okay? The news media is covering it. So you're talking to the whole world. Okay? Now, everybody say, peace and love! Peace and love! Now, when you go home and watch, is that the way you want to be? <laughs> It's only noon, one more place after us, and that's Hawaii. So it started hours ago in New Zealand, and it's gone all around the world now. So from a, the start of this was in Chicago, and it was like, yeah, I see you waving, darling. It's time for the countdown? Anyway, you'll read all about it. Are you ready? I'm going to count to five, four. Of event for such a great cause. I was alive when Marilyn Monroe was Oh, sweet, look what they just gave me. It's a cookie. Dad! 
I love you, Tiny. This guy got a cookie too. Well, I don't think they will. So they literally just handed me four of those cookies. So if I can figure out a way to ship them, Patreons, you're, some of you random Patreon people are gonna get some uh, Ringo Star birthday cookies. Shh, don't tell the post office. You love England. The worst bands in the world came from there. The Beatles, the Stones, Led Zeppelin. Yeah. You having a good day today? I'm having a good day. Oh, it seems like the peace and love theme has moved into the crowd. It has moved into the crowd. Everybody's here out of peace and love. And it's as hard as to be, but to spread peace and love throughout the world. They share our birthdays. I was born July 7th just like Ringo. They share a birthday with Ringo. We do. Nice. In the same style. years apart now. Nice Grateful Dead one. Well, thanks Ringo. Look at this guy next to Adam in the uh, Sergeant Pepper outfit. Happy birthday, Ringo. Well, in the film industry, I think we could say this is a wrap. I just wanted to send a big shout out. Thank you to new Patreons and donors, uh, Robin Benjamin Bell, Mary Boone, and Phil White. Thank you so much for your generosity. Oh, and guys, I hit 3,000 subscribers today. Thank you so much. It's far exceeded my expectations or my goals for my first year of vlogging, so thank you very much. I appreciate that you guys have found something in my channel that you want to come back for every day and that it's growing every day. So, man, it's what an optimistic thing to get to feel every day. So, thank you very much, guys. And I think I'm just going to randomly select a few of you guys and... Um... I don't know whether I'm going to send you a bracelet and a cookie or if I maybe I'll just make it for six different people. Yeah, probably six different people. So if you're a Patreon or, or a donor and you are a Ringo or Beatles fan, comment on this video and let me know and maybe I'll send it to you. Thank you guys. Well, I figured out what to do with my peace band. I'm not going to wear it every day because it'll just break. I've broken enough of those in my life to know. I'll just put it right there on Socrates' head. Oh, what a beautiful evening. 3,000 subscribers. Thank you so much, guys. Can't wait to see what future holds for all of us. Hollywood, California. Good night. Good night.